We've posted a link on krqe.com. Have you been watching it? No, I have no, not watched it. It's fantastic. You need to watch it. Yeah, I know. I've heard good know. things about I'm gonna, it. I, I'm going to keep asking you till you watch it. So. I watched Breaking Bad, but I haven't yeah, watched Better Call Saul. you got to catch up. No. All right. It was a nicer day out there, Jess. Very nice. A lot more sunshine, mm -hmm. and the winds came down today. Just some high, thin clouds here in Albuquerque. A little bit of a different story in the southern half of the state in places like Cloudcroft and the Sacramento Mountains. A little bit more in the way of cloud cover down there. That's thanks to a cold front that moved through. Just some leftover clouds this evening in parts of New Mexico, but a gorgeous evening as you head out the door for that dinner or a movie or a walk this evening. Just be sure to grab that jacket because it is on the cooler side. Thanks to that cold front. You can see those clouds in the Sacramento Mountains that I just showed you, but plenty of clear skies in central and northern New Mexico. And take a look at the 24 hour temperature change. It's as much as 25 degrees cooler in Tucum Carry, 18 degrees cooler right now in Las Vegas, and 10 degrees cooler here in the metro compared to last night at this time. So that's why you'll need that jacket heading out the door. Temperatures in the middle 60s right now, 65 in Roswell. 50 degrees in Ruidoso and 69 in Socorro, but it won't take long for these temperatures to warm back up to above average highs as we head into the Easter holiday. So for tonight, what you will notice eventually if you're out and about later on this evening are the canyon breezes picking up this evening and they'll last into the early morning hours. It will stay on the breezy side in central and eastern New Mexico for tomorrow afternoon, but our temperatures will be warming up. A little weak weather disturbance will be passing to our south tomorrow, so that will throw in a few extra clouds and could trigger an isolated sprinkle or two around the higher terrain in New Mexico, but it's not going to be a big deal by Sunday. It will be on the windier side for much of the state and temperatures continuing to climb back above average. We'll be close to 80 degrees here in Albuquerque by the beginning of the upcoming week. So timing out the winds for this evening again between now and 9 o'clock. The winds not much of a factor. It's not until about 10 o'clock tonight into the midnight hour that those winds kick up out of the east. We're seeing that blue that's indicating those breezier conditions here in Albuquerque and in the eastern half of the state. Then as we head into the day on Saturday after lunchtime, especially in northeastern Mexico, that's where the strongest winds will be gusting up to 40 miles per hour there. Roswell and Carlsbad, it will be breezy to windy as well. And then as we head into Easter Sunday, all of us feeling the breezier conditions with those winds, especially picking up around the four corners. So here's your extended forecast for Durango, Pagosa Springs and Cortez. Kind of like last night, it's going to be a colder night. Temperatures falling back into the teens and the 20s, rebounding into low to mid 60s. But looking good for anything that you have planned outdoors this weekend for the Easter holiday in southern Colorado. Over to the four corners, a lot of sunshine, breezy at times. Winds out of the southeast at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Temperatures starting out in the 20s. So needing that jacket to start by the afternoon, not too bad. Warmer than today, topping out in the low to mid 70s in Farmington, Gallup and Grants. Over to the southwest, temperatures into the 40s tonight, rebounding into the 60s and the 70s. Again, a little bit more way of cloud cover here in southern New Mexico tonight and also on your Saturday. Then we warm things up for Sunday and Monday back to near 80 degrees. Over to the southeast, wind sustained out of the south from 15 to 25 with gusts up to 35. Still on the cooler side with highs in the 50s and the 60s. But it's going to feel like early summer by Easter Sunday. High temperatures back into the lower 80s. Over to the northeast, the winds will be the strongest here, gusting up to 40 miles per hour for tomorrow. Temperatures into the 60s. Then we warm back up into the lower 70s by Monday. And then over to the northern mountains, mostly sunny skies. Temperatures into the 60s in Santa Fe, 67 in Española, and 61 in Taos. And then over to the East Mountains, partly cloudy skies. Breezes kicking up out of the south from 10 to 20 miles per hour. Fire danger going up next week with our temperatures warming up to near 70 degrees in Edgewood. And in the metro, those canyon winds picking up later on this evening. It will be breezy tomorrow afternoon. Temperatures warmer back into the 70s. And we're going to stay dry. That's the bad news here. So fire danger is going to be concerned over the next seven days off and on with breezy to windy conditions, especially by the middle of next week. Perfect for Easter egg hunting on Sunday. Yeah, it's, it's going nice to be nice and even warmer than it was today. So looking right. good. Thank you, Chris. Um,